We're in the Analyze Results section and we want to apply a filter and a comparison to the data that we have here. If we scroll down, we can see we have three female responses and two male. And we can see that we have three students in first year, one in second year, one in third year. Now, if we go up to here and under the current view, we can choose the filter option to filter by question and answer. So we can choose the question that we want to filter by. In this case, we're going to filter and we're going to choose all that we want to see. So if we just want to see the females, we click on female, click apply, and it will update to show us only the responses from the three females. So we can see the three females and we have two in first year and one in second year. If we want, we can then delete the rule so that it goes back to uh, click and delete and we go back to seeing all our responses. Notice that under filter, we can also filter by a number of other different options, including by collector, which means that if you have multiple collectors, so different URLs or different ways of collecting your data, you can filter to see only the responses by a particular collector. To compare results, so say we want to do a comparison between, uh, in this case, maybe we want to see the different years of the of the students who responded broken down by their gender. So here we can compare by question and answer. Choosing the sex variable here, we can choose to compare females against males. So you can choose two options here and click apply. And what will happen is it will produce separately the results for males and females differently. So obviously it doesn't really make sense on the variable sex, but if you go down here, you can see the breakdown for males and females for the year of study. So we have the results for females here, the results for males here. And you can see in your table how that breaks down as well in terms of the different years and the number of males and females in each. To clear a comparison, just like we did before, you just click on drop down and click on delete rule. And that will then bring us back to viewing all responses.